New at five, a freak accident at a local church daycare lands one child in the hospital. News 10's Lacey Clifton joins us now to explain exactly what happened. Lacey. January 23rd at 4.47 p.m., a date and time that will always stick out in one Wabash Valley mother's mind. That's when she called 911 as her little boy was badly hurt at daycare. It's any mother's worst nightmare. I immediately hear, don't climb on that, get off of there, followed by two pretty terrifying crashes. The scary situation that would unfold in minutes at her son's daycare was mom Lee Aaron Fortner's reality. And I see my oldest child, who is 10, um, standing holding this um, foldable stage. He's holding it up and his legs underneath it and I see blood. I get over there and I start to lift it off of what, I, what I'm assuming is my oldest child. But to Learen's horror, she finds her eight-year-old pinned under the stage's frame. He's screaming to get off his head. His head hurts. He's throwing his legs. After Learen's call to 911, little John is taken by ambulance to Terre Haute Regional Hospital. I didn't know what was going on because I hadn't actually got to talk to the doctor yet. I just heard we were getting airlifted to Riley. And the doctor comes in and tells me that He's got a, a decompressed skull fracture where the, his skull is pushing on his brain. Later that night, John underwent surgery to pull the skull back into place and set it with screws and plates. Learen says doctors are hopeful his skull will repair itself, but in young children, it can go either way. If it's one thing she's learned from this experience, it's to talk to your children about being aware of their surroundings. I've never thought that I would need to sit down and tell my, tell my children, like, look around you if there's something that can fall on you don't don't play by it it's just a standard you know you would think that somebody would be watching to tell your child that now i did reach out to the church where john's daycare is held and they didn't want to comment on the accident but tune in to